Well, many cities and towns are now instituting indoor mask mandates to help with the spread of COVID-19. And one of those cities is New London. It comes amid a call to action from the Southeastern Connecticut Council of Governments, which New London is part of. They sent a letter to Governor Lamont Wednesday calling on him to issue a statewide indoor mask mandate. Joining us now to talk more about that mandate is New London Mayor Michael Passero. Mayor Passero, thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. So, you know, you and, and other local municipality leaders here in the state are going not against what the governor is saying, but just going a little bit more strict than what the governor is saying and making these mandates for your own cities and towns. What response have you heard so far from individuals and business owners in New London? The response so far has been overwhelmingly positive uh, from the residents in the city. Uh, we, uh, we waited to do this until we had a partnership with, uh, with other area uh, municipalities. So um, the city of Groton and the town of Groton have, have joined in this mask mandate. Why is it so important to get everyone on board here? We did hear from the governor that he's not going to issue the statewide mask mandate, but leave it up to different communities. But it really becomes a regional thing, right? Yeah, the, the, the virus doesn't uh, respect uh, municipal boundaries and certainly the residents in this area, we live in, in more or less uh, uh, geographically small communities. New London is only five and a half square miles. So unless we act together, uh, we, we don't believe that the, the precautions would be um, effective. You along um, with the, oh, I'm sorry. sorry, go ahead, Mayor. Well, uh, the Southeastern Council of Governments, we've worked as a team and um, and the letter to the governor by by the Council of Governments was to ask him and uh, to recommend that he issue a statewide uh, mask mandate. Um, many of the municipalities are still reluctant to to act on their own, uh, but the city of Groton, the town of Groton and the city of New London felt that um, the situation was urgent enough that that we would move forward and the Council of Governments will continue to uh, reconsider their position. Let's talk about enforcement as far as New London's concerned. What if an individual, a business owner, uh, isn't following the rules that you have set forth for your city going forward? What, what kind of penalties might they be facing? We, we have no penalties built into uh, the executive order. Um, so we are going to be um, just uh, gently, uh, you know, expecting cooperation. We. We don't expect to have that type of a problem. We've had good cooperation throughout this pandemic, and we believe the businesses in this city uh, will, and the residents will cooperate with this. It is really um, a minor inconvenience. And most or a lot of the businesses already have this mask mandate. So we feel like this, uh, this emergency order just backs up what people um, are asking for. And Mayor, how long do you think that all of this is going to last? Is there a, a certain metric that you're looking for in New London that you're saying, okay, maybe if we can get to this point, we don't have to have this indoor mask mandate? What, what, we're, what we're trying to do now is protect those, those people with um, compromised immune systems and our children, schools getting ready to start. I think that was a big factor in wanting to put this into place. Our children are still not able to get vaccinated. So we believe we have a responsibility to do everything we can to protect them. This Delta variant is, um, has just thrown a monkey wrench into our ability to control this pandemic. I am proud of the vaccination uh, rates that we are having in New London. Uh, I mean, our 65 and above population, we have a 90, 98% vaccination rate. So we are doing really, really well. But in the different age categories, it drops uh, after that. Um, as you get down to the, you know, for instance, 18 to 24 year old uh, age rate, it, age group, it's only 30% that we have vaccinated. So we still have a good deal of work to do uh, to get our population vaccinated. And that really is the answer. That's the secret. We can get out from under this mask mandate if we can get more cooperation on the vaccination. Indoor mask mandate in New London and the mayor of the city of New London, Michael Passero. Mayor, thanks for joining us. No, thank you very much. Appreciate it.